Five, a plot twist in a puppy rescue. The Mequon Police Department found four puppies abandoned on the side of the road. One of the pups did not make it, unfortunately. But today, our Angelica Sanchez witnessed a reunion that no one saw coming. That's right, guys. I'm near the area where these puppies were located. Had it not been for the kindness of strangers, I don't think these puppies would have survived yesterday's storm. Fox 6 was the only camera in the room when these puppies reunited. It's a story that just might tug at your heartstrings. Do you want me to pick you up? I just need to love you a little. This is Brad. You are so sweet. A lovable pup who has had an adventurous week. I can't imagine what it was like it just for a couple days being out there alone in the forest. On Monday, Mequon PD responded to reports of a puppy wandering near Cedarburg and Highland Road. They found four puppies abandoned by the side of the road. They took them to the Wisconsin Humane Society's Ozaki campus. They are um, currently being, you know, evaluated. We have our vet staff and behavior staff looking after them. One of the pups did not survive. They were very weak when they first arrived. But no one expected what would happen next. Today, there was a huge plot twist. A woman found Brad the fifth puppy of the litter. She gave him shelter before Thursday's big storm. Neither Brad nor his litter knew they were in the same building. We were there as this crew was finally reunited. The Humane Society isn't sure where these animals came from, but they have a message for anyone struggling to care for a pet. We will welcome you with open arms. We will never turn away an animal in need. The puppies will soon be put up for adoption, each one more than ready to fill a home with love. Yeah, maybe they can't communicate, but I think in their own way, they're also still telling us that they're just so glad that someone found them and brought them here. Now, there are a lot of ways that you at home can help these puppies or any other animal at the Humane Society, and that's through foster care or monetary donations. We have that information for you at fox6now.com. Just click on this story. Live in Mequon tonight, Angelica Sanchez, Fox 6 News. And it looks like they have no problems, you know, interacting with people. They're not afraid of them. They're just happy. So sweet. Oh. They were so sweet. Thanks for our dose of cuteness, Angie. Thanks.